Good morning, Living Hope. It's Sunday, April 16th, and here are your announcements for the week. Come back tonight at 5 p.m. and join us for family celebration. We're excited to recognize those who've joined our church in recent months, fellowship together, and celebrate how the Lord is moving at Living Hope. During the evening, we'll also be going over the proposed changes to our church structure document. There will be a short Q&A tonight, but a longer one is scheduled for Sunday, April 23rd. If you're a guest with us, whether for the first time or you've been here before, we would love to help connect you to Living Hope. You can help us out with this by filling out a connection card found in the seat back in front of you. This card helps us know how we can serve you best right now. Are you wanting to know more about faith in Jesus? Or want to know more about hope groups or getting baptized? Just fill out the card and place it in the offering plate as they go by later in the service. We'll take care of the rest. There is so much happening in the life of our church right now, so we encourage you to check out The Hope, our news and events page. You can get to The Hope three ways. First, by scanning the QR code on the front of the worship guide. Two, get connected on the Church Center app and find a link at the bottom of the home screen. Or three, visit us at lhbc.net slash the hope. Before our announcements end today, we want you to take a look at this special invitation to Secret Church 2023. Hey, I want to personally invite you to this year's Secret Church. The reason we do Secret Church, like the whole name Secret Church, is to identify with our sisters and brothers around the world who live in difficult, dangerous places for Christians, and they have to meet in secret. We chose Jonah for this Secret Church to dive into this Bible book because it has shocking relevance to our lives and the state of the world today and the state of the church in the world. The way it speaks to what God has called us to do, who God has called us to be as the church in the world today, I cannot wait to go on this journey, to dive into intensive study in God's word for hours and to identify with our brothers and sisters around the world who have to meet in secret and pray for them and to give to what God's doing in and through them to let them know they're not alone. You will not regret spending hours together with some other brothers and sisters diving into the Word and praying for the persecuted church around the world. And see how God, by His Spirit, opens our eyes in a fresh way to what He's doing in the world and what He's invited you and I to be a part of in it. Amen.